This means a great deal. This is a very important day in the lives of the residents of Pajarito Mesa. Bernalillo County leaders have created a new emergency system for the estimated 800 people who live on the Pajarito Mesa, an unplanned community with few legal roads and basic services in far southwestern Bernalillo County. Nearly 800 people in 192 homes live on the Mesa. Today, for the first time, these families have the option to sign up for a structure ID. So now they're gonna have, I don't wanna call it an address because it's not, a, it's not an address, but it's a structure ID. There are very few legal addresses on Pajarito Mesa, which means in the past, emergency responders have relied on landmarks and general descriptions to find fires, medical emergencies, and reports of crime. Well, you know, probably one of the most important things of, of of public safety is being able to get to your emergency quick. And it's a well-known fact that the sooner we can get there in, in any type of emergency, whether it's fire, medical, or law enforcement, uh, the better the outcome. Uh, in the past, uh, when an emergency arised in the community, people would call emergency services, but without the knowledge of where to go or how the community was set, I mean, sometimes it would take a long time, and, and that could mean the, the time between life and death. Uh, interaction with the citizens we feel is an imperative to uh, helping us protect and uh, serving the people the best we can. We also believe that the interaction and in, in actually mobilizing our human resources and our assets with this program will uh, help efficiency and better serve this, uh, this small community of Pajarito Mesa. This project is one of many to improve living conditions for the families of Pajarito Mesa. We want to make sure that everyone is safe. To that end, we have this fire truck right behind me that was about a quarter million dollar investment on the county's part. We have a water station that now provides clean water. Now you got to come get it in the tank, but at least there's portable clean water. We have signs at the bottom of the, of the hill that tell people that if you buy land here, it's very likely illegal. It's illegal because you can't subdivide it. So we've really done everything we can to suppress movement onto the Mesa. We have a full-time county staff member that works here every day that reports either illegal dumping or someone moving here illegally as well. We have also now have this emergency system in place, which will allow our emergency response teams to get here quickly to find you in an emergency. So the county has taken some positive steps on for a community that's frankly off the grid. The Pajarito Mesa Structure Identification Project is voluntary. Families or individuals can contact the county to have a metal sign with a unique number placed at their home. The sign would be connected to a specific location on a map. Families, people that reside here are going to have to request, because it's totally voluntary, you're going to have to request a structure number, a home number. Now it's not an address, uh, but it is a number that will identify on a map, and so when they call 911, they will be able to be identified on the map. Law enforcement will get that same map on their visuals, as well as our fire. To sign up for the Pajarito Mesa Structure Identification Project, please call the Bernalillo County Fire Department at 505-468-1310. Bernalillo County, we're more than you think.